In this section of the video, we're going to do some demonstration of harvesting techniques. And before us, we have a whole crop of bib lettuce. It's six weeks of age and it has been transplanted in the channels for about four weeks. So we can see that the heads are starting to close in nicely and we have a mature and very saleable crop. Now, the first thing that we have already completed here is we've pinched off all the lines to allow most of the solution to drain out of the channels. After we've completed that step, we're ready to begin harvesting. The first and simple step that we do is to create a little bit of separation between the nearby lettuce heads so as we pull out this channel we don't create any tearing or any damage to the to the mature leaves. We'll simply pop the channel out of the drain line and pull it across our aisle way. We've already made a V in the channels on the other side to create an opening for the channel to rest on on the bench on the other side. Now we have access to all of the lettuce heads for harvest. Now that we have the channel in place in the aisle, easily accessible, we're ready to harvest. I've gone ahead and put on gloves to maintain the most um, sanitary conditions as possible for our fresh uh, lettuce crop. And then I'm simply going to slide my fingers under the head of lettuce and uh, gently lift up both the head of lettuce and the rock wool cube which exposes a lot of the uh, root material. I'm gonna go ahead and break off the majority of this root material with my hand. The next step is to remove any of the older or damaged leaves from the bottom of the lettuce head, anything that we don't wanna sell in our package. So there I've removed four or five leaves and we now have a ready to market head of lettuce. Once we have the roots and the older leaves removed from our lettuce, we're now ready to package it. We have two general packaging methods that growers use. The first is what we would call a premium pack, where the where an individual lettuce head is placed in either a crisper, which is a plastic clamshell, or an individual sleeve. So we're going to demonstrate for you packaging it in a crisper. I'm going to take the head of lettuce in one hand and place it in the top of the crisper top of the lettuce down very gently and then I'm going to come around and tuck in the older leaves right in the bottom of the crisper. With no leaf surface exposed, we'll simply snap the top of the crisper closed. That places the root cube and the remaining roots in the small reservoir at the bottom of the crisper and presents for us a packaged individual head of lettuce ready for sale. It's common for growers to have a pre-printed and personalized label that they can also place on the top of the crisper for farm identification. If you're not planning to individually market each head of lettuce as we just demonstrated in the crisper, the other most common method of packaging is a bulk pack, wherein lettuce are placed generally by the dozen into a cardboard box which has a one mil plastic liner, which you can also get from Crop King. So once we have our liner uh, carefully placed in our box, we're simply going to pack the heads of lettuce that have had the um, older leaves removed and the roots pruned. These will simply be placed in the box, root down. We're then simply going to repeat this process until the box is full. Mm -hmm. Then the remaining portion of the plastic liner can be pulled over the boxes and they can be either taped or folded shut. Mm -hmm. 